Hi, this is Jelana Van Bean, and in this segment, we're going to talk about layouts for small vegetable gardens. Now, you don't have to have a house in the country or acres of land to grow a vegetable garden. All you need is a sunny spot. And you could even grow one on your back deck if you live in an apartment and you don't have a lot of space. Or if you live in an older folks home and you have a little plot in the community garden, you don't need a large area to have a great vegetable garden. So when you're laying out your vegetable gardens, I try to follow some rules. If it's a really small garden, you might not get away with growing corn, but then you might too, because corn needs at least three feet by three feet to grow. So if you put that in the center of your garden, then you can still put all types of vegetables around it. Or if it's still that small and you only have a small container, then go for some smaller vegetables. For example, peas, snap peas, are great for gardens and they need very little space. They make a vine and then they can only be three inches apart. So you can always grow them up to a fence or you can grow them in a little container and make a little teepee for them to grow up and it doesn't need a lot of space at all. Different plants like spinach and lattice too, you can mix with your other plants. And as long as they have five inches between them, they will grow very easily. So they're one of the easy, easy vegetables to grow. And even plants like cauliflower and carrots don't need a whole lot of space to grow. So even by putting them next to each other or making a zigzag with your plants, as long as they're only six inches to a foot apart, you have plenty of room. So when you're laying out a small vegetable garden, remember less is more. So only grow the plants that you know that you will eat. So grow vegetables that you enjoy. And then that way you can make your own salads in your own kitchen and enjoy the fruits of your garden, even if it's only three feet by three feet wide.